new or returning, whichever, I am very happy to see you. I know I have not been on in a really long time. Um, if you've been keeping up with the community posts at all, you might have seen that my grandmother did pass. May she rest in peace. Um, it's definitely not helped motivate me to get back on track and doing these things, but she was a really big supporter and she will be missed, but I know that she would want me to keep going, so I will be pushing through and I hope you guys can relax some. I have definitely been partaking in more ASMR help reduce stress in the recent weeks. Um, so I hope I can kind of help contribute back again in a way that's always helped me. So I'd like to begin by reading a passage. Just because, if you can't tell by the title, this is a video for when you're not quite feeling great, and for when you're not quite feeling like the tables to be turned abruptly. Maybe you want to feel however you feel, and really feel it, because that's healthy too. You need to experience some of the bad emotions sometimes. You can't just ignore them and lock them away. So, I hope... <laughs> I hope this can help. Can help you guys. Can help you guys some. It's not too long. There is a place in the heart space, and even during the best moments and the greatest times, we will know it. We will know it more than ever. There is a place in the heart that will never be filled, and we will wait When you lose someone, in any capacity, you might feel that void, like a piece of your heart is gone, or maybe a piece of yourself is missing. So, I just like that, that piece a lot. You might see me tear up throughout this, and I'm sorry, it's out kind of randomly think of her. It doesn't need more explanation. <laughs> um, I thought I would do a more blue, blue, blue theme today because that's what I'm. I do actually love the color blue, obviously, but today, I think it's very fitting, so let's just, we're going to try, we're going to try to brush off some of this.
cleaned and prepped for this relaxing experience, okay? So just don't mind me. I want to soothe. Soothe. Personally, I'm quite parched, so I feel like this might cover, absorb some of the sounds a bit. Sounds muted. or reading or having to write out a feeling, so to speak. So, enjoy this kind of blue artwork. It is abstract. any of you like to create art or maybe listen to music or look at art when they're feeling a certain way rather than trying to engage, let me know down below. I'm always interested to see how people will psychologically 
misunderstood word in today's day and age. People either hear trauma and they think, oh, it has to be something huge that happened. Some huge event that is newsworthy, which is not true. It can be, but it does not have to be. It could be very small. It doesn't even have to be physical. physically done to you. Because again, I feel like another stereotype is, oh, were they beaten? Were they physically abused somehow? No. There's all shapes and form of trauma. And the other side of trauma is I feel like, like the word crazy. People are like, oh, he's crazy. Crazy is a big word and it's used very casually. And I feel like trauma is similar, in a similar boat right now. People hear trauma and they're like, oh, everyone's got trauma. Blah, 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 blah. Which, to a certain extent, a lot of people, they do have trauma. Because, again, it's, it's, it doesn't have to be catastrophic to affect you. But that's just me rambling. I'm not going to read much of this. It's, um. Uh, it's more sciencey, psychological book. More her explaining factoids and her doctor experiences. Lots of citations in the back, so if you'd like to learn about it, I haven't read it yet. I've only just started, so I can't. saw the Matisse, the Matisse cut out on the cover, and that's what sold me. Well, that and had a lot of good reviews. I really love reading. I would highly recommend reading. It can also be therapeutic. This is a little Ikea nightlight. And I really like his sounds. I know this video was not my usual. I know I've been out of the game for a while, and I do apologize about that. And not because I took the time for myself, but because I know you guys that do actually like my videos probably missed it to a certain degree, so I'm sorry that I was gone, but they were kind of 
circumstances that could not be helped. Unfortunately, I wish they could have been. But I, on top of my normal everyday issues trying to avoid burnout, that just definitely, again, did not help. So, your girl is trying to get back in the saddle, so to speak. So please, just a gentle reminder to tell the ones that you love that you love them more often, because you never know what's going to happen. And that's a reminder to take care of yourself, too, and to say what you want and mean and need. To take care of yourself, to love yourself. Self-care is important. Taking care of everyone else's too, but you gotta remember yourself, okay? So I want you to feel however you need to feel right now. If it's sad, so be it. You are not alone, okay? You are not. You are not alone at all. I'm here with you, okay? At the very least, I'm here with you. And things will get better. They will. With time, I don't know how much time. Every circumstance is different for everyone, but listen, listen, ch -ch -ch. we got this, we got this, we'll figure it out as we go, it's the whole point of life, right? We have no other choice, and it's terrifying, but exciting, so unfortunately the bad must come with the good, but I'm so, so thankful for the good, and I'm very thankful that you guys are here with me. And I appreciate you very much. And remember to appreciate what you have as well. It really helps. Okay? So with that in mind, you go to sleep. You get some deep, deep, deep sleep. Okay? Restful, restorative. You need it. Everyone needs that. They need the good, good. Okay? Now please do subscribe. I promise I'm normally much more active. copy the link and don't share it. It makes YouTube think you love me more, so I appreciate you guys once again. I'm glad to be back. I hope you're all doing okay, and until I see you guys next time,